the Leader of Her Majesty's Loyal Opposition. Thank you and good morning, Speaker. My question is for the Minister of Finance. February 21, 2017, the Minister of Finance said, quote, we're looking at a balanced budget in this coming budget, next year as well, and the year after that. Wrong. The province's books will be balanced this spring and for the foreseeable future, insists Finance Minister Charles Sousa. Quote, wrong. The Minister of Finance again said, I will confirm that we are on track to deliver balanced budgets for the next two years as well. Wrong. This government can't be trusted. Mr. Speaker, after two years of Question. promising a balanced budget, how does the finance minister sure. think he has any, sure. any credibility Thank left you. with the people of Ontario? Minister of Finance. Mr. Speaker, <clears throat> we have worked hard and long to slay the deficit throughout the past five it. years. Mr. Speaker, because of the hard work of the people of this province, yeah. we also have a surplus, Mr. Speaker, right here and now. Over the last 40 years, over the last 40 years, the Conservatives have balanced the budget only three times, Mr. Speaker. During the federal government, they've recorded the largest deficits in history and the largest debt accumulation anywhere in Canada's history. We're balanced, we're in surplus, and we're going to continue to work for the people of Ontario. You see it, please? You see it, please? I'm now going to use this round as to tell us that we're in warnings. While the minister was answering, even his own side was making heckling noises that I was, made it difficult for me to hear, and both sides need to bring it down a tone, and if you don't, I will. Supplementary. Back to the minister. Well, again, the minister of finance said, quote, we have outperformed, and as a result, we're coming to balance next year and the year after that. His fall economic statement said, quote, the government is continuing to protect a balanced budget 2017-18 and ongoing balance in 18-19 and 2019-20. News reports announced Sousa confirmed last fall that Ontario's 2018 budget will be balanced, oh. as, will balance, as will budgets over the next two years, Speaker. None of that was correct. This is the opposite of the truth spread by a government willing to say anything to power. Mr. Getting very close to saying something you know would be unparliamentary. <coughs> Don't do that tip rope for me, please, and if you do, I'll ask you to withdraw the next time. Mr. Speaker, how can the Minister of Finance Question. tell us one thing when he knows the complete opposite to be true? Thank you. Minister. So we've taken a hard stand, disciplined and determined approach to balance the budget this year and to have a surplus now. Now we have a choice. Now the Conservatives have made their choice. They have already said they are going into deficit. And they further say that they're going to make cuts yeah. through a lot of revenue generation, including carbon pricing. They have a $16 billion hole in their plan, Mr. Speaker. What are they going to cut? What are they going to do? We made our choice here. Mr. Speaker, we've chosen to support mental health. We've chosen to support social services. We're yeah. chosen to support students yeah. and elder care. Yeah. We could choose not to do those things, Mr. Speaker. Answer. In, the, in these uncertain times, we choose to support them, People. recognizing that there's some turbulence in the market. We are not going to yeah. let anybody behind. Thank you. Thank you. Be seated, please. Be seated, please. Thank you. Final supplementary. Back to the minister. Let me read more quotes. Finance, quote, Finance Minister Charles Sousa announced that not only will the province's budget be balanced this year, it will continue to not slip into deficit into 2018 or 19 as well. Now, we know that's not accurate. 
The 2017 budget read, not only are we presenting a balanced budget this year, we are on track for balanced budgets in 18, 19, 20, 20, and 19, 20. We know that's not accurate. After two years of promising a balanced budget, I guess we can't be surprised the minister decided to support Liberal insiders instead. Mr. Speaker, we need to know, was it the Premier who made the Minister of Finance run an $8 billion Question. deficit? Thank you. Minister. So, Mr. Speaker, we are tracking to remain fiscally responsible <coughs> for the province of Ontario. You bet we are, unlike you. The people of Ontario have asked. So we are. The member from Bruce Gray Owen Sound is warned. They've asked us to manage government finances effectively. They've also asked us to help them manage their finances as well. We could choose not to do that, Mr. Speaker. We could choose not to support mental health. We could choose not to support hospitals. We could choose not to support students and more education. We could choose not to support elder care and seniors care. We could choose not to do those things just to stay in balance. But we chose our values, and our values are shared with the people of Ontario. And they value us to help them, and we're not going to cut them as they would.